Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another blog tech tips. And of course, guys, today I'm going to show you how to get rid of any malware you might have or pop up ads on the Samsung Galaxy S10. Alright, guys, so let's go straight into it. Now, the first thing you want to do in situations where you have um, virus issues is I recommend that you actually go ahead and go to your Play Store, which is the Google Play Store. Search for a software, which is the AVG is the one I recommended or any other good antivirus. Um, there are many types as you can see down here um, There are other suggestions, but for me, I usually use the AVG um, Antivirus so you can go ahead and hit install also you have the Avira and other Antiviruses, it's all about personal preference, but I can tell you this one works quite fine. So once you install this All right, so once it's um, installed as shown here, just go ahead and open up the software or the antivirus all right so once you're finished um, installing or enjoy the um, setup just go ahead and scan your device and of course the software should scan and remove any potential threats that's already on your device so that's the first thing you want to do next once your phone is in a power down state you're gonna hit power and volume down but first start with power as soon as you see the Samsung logo keep holding uh, power down do not let go and there, you, and there you go guys you should be now be in um, safe mode you should say safe mode right down here you'll have to enter your password once you enter your password, just give it a few seconds. You should notice some grayed out icons. You are now in safe mode as indicated here. Do not worry, it's easy to exit. Simply restart your phone. Now from here, let's say um, you install recent software. And as soon as you install those software, your device was working fine. And then you started to have issues with viruses. It would indicate that the software you install lost or last is the cause of the issue. So just go ahead and check out the last installed software. And then of course let's go through all third party has been dis um, disabled and let's say for example it was um, something like um, this one here although it's not it let's go ahead and hit uninstall and from here you can also delete other files and so on and especially if you see that you're not getting the pop-up ads in this mode it would indicate that something you have installed has caused the issue all right and once you're finished let's go ahead and do the drawdown or the drop down menu right here and let's go ahead right now and simply tap here and then simply turn off safe mode. All right, guys, in um, most other cases, if that didn't work, the next thing you want to do, cases, guys, if that didn't work, then most are the next thing you want to do is to actually just go ahead and um, back up your device. Once you back up your device, go to um, settings. And of course, in general management, And on the general management, just go to reset and make sure you back up as I said before. What you want to do from here is to do a factory and data reset. And once you do that, follow the instructions on screen and your device will be um, erased. Now, erasing your device in most cases is enough to fix the um, problem. You can restore your device later on when you're finished. There are tools such as um, Samsung keys that can be installed on your PC to use for the backup process. And of course, you can manually backup as well and restore at the end of um, the process now um, final result that I've found too that work in most extreme cases especially if the uh, malware is very severe I have tutorials on how to block specific ads I'll link to it somewhere on screen around here and of course uh, if all else fails you may have to flash your device um, again Samsung offers tools in order to restore the um, device firmware in which you would actually um, erase everything as uh, some most advanced viruses that exist now even if you reset they do come back as they have in embedded themselves in the um, software on your phone in that case you'll need to do uh, is get a fresh version of the operating system or the android operating system on your device and allow the um it to be restored 100% by flashing the device or flashing a new ROM or flashing the custom ROM once again. Once you do that, it should get rid of the virus. 
that's how in most cases we have fixed the most stubborn um, viruses that's out there right guys so this has been how to get rid of malware or viruses or pop-up ads on the samsung galaxy s10 please do um check out our other videos this is ricardo going from blog to tips and bye until next time bye